tag 2 requires an attribute for it to actually show us the image on the web page. Now this attribute is called src which is the short for source. So this attribute basically tells the browser where to look for the image which we are going to include on this particular web page. Now this attribute value in this case is actually the URL of the image. Now okay let's go ahead and actually put in some attribute value to it. The syntax is exactly similar after the attribute name which is src you put an equal to sign and then you drop in opening and closing inverted double inverted commas now let us include the image so I have just copied the image from internet I just got the exact URL for the image which ends in .jpg you don't need to have an extension in the last I mean if it is there in the URL you need to have it but if it's not there in the URL you can even the URL just be the exact location of should be the exact location of the image whether or not it has the extension in the last it's it's not compulsory so this is how you actually include a uh, image in your web page now of course apart from source there are different attributes which we will see in upcoming videos